He's dead. Dead. My eagle eye spotted that little looks. All right, left into this field. The unmistakable sound of an annoying lux. Yeah, no kidding. I'm recording, by the way, for the first time in quite a while, actually. Okay. So we can make all them naughty derogatory jokes. Oh yeah. The naughtier the better. Get that YouTube uh, that YouTube algorithm Every just a ripping. Crossroads. All right, Gunner, load smoke. Need a uh, new gear up on crossroads. I took it down. Yeah, King, I'm gonna drop a uh, supply drop by your outpost. Yeah, there's a spy over there. Yeah, yeah I see that. Spot. Driver, get us up to the move mark. All right, recon's up, showing all the infantry around the north of the crossroads. Gunner, we're gonna put a smoke shell on my attack mark. Uh, once we get to the move mark. I think they have a carry up on the north of the crossroads here. Load smoke again. Uh, hard no, right, driver, hard right, yeah, hard right, other right. On my well, I've already started going left. Yeah. It's alright. Let's go right. Okay, forward here. Move into this field. Got smoke up, Gunner. Yeah. I'm going to get a straight right next to you. Alright. So watch out. I've just got cameo in there. Squad hunt to watch out as well. Never mind. Left here onto the road, actually. We'll follow the infantry up. Alright, drop a smoke right here, gunner. Load smoke again. Driver forward. Fucking Look out, enemy right next to us. Yeah, he's dead. You want me to move forward? Yep, yep, forward. That's game. Thank you for killing that guy, Mullet. No problem. That was for us? Yeah, behind us somewhere. I'm looking. Hey, uh, Sherman, look out. You've got, uh, you've got AT behind you somewhere. We got it. We got it. Alright, alright. We got it. Alright, we're going to hang a right at the move mark, where this purple dragon guy is. Yes, no glass for Okay, right here, right here, we should be able to squeeze in. This is shit, Gary. Good. Going to hit crossroads with a reinforce. And uh -huh. driver halt. What's Aaron? People straight ahead. All right, Gunner, put a smoke at uh, 293 in front of us. And then load HE. All right. Driver pivot right to 325. Oh, what? We lost. Yeah. Apparently <laughs> something was being captured and we didn't even know. The fuck, my. All right. That was something. See what the next map is. If it's Hill 400, we're definitely tanking on Hill 400. Why? Why would you do that? Because I'm it's a, a shit gamer. Map. I'm a real gamer. Fucking horrible map to tank on. <laughs> you should ask Crotalus about the time that me and Cossack and him were in a Panther on Hill 400. I mean, if you want me to be tank commander and you drive, then that's fine. Okay. 
I'll Let's happily take command is. on fucking Hill 400. <laughs> I'm not driving on that map. Fuck that. I ain't driving on no fucking Hill 400, mate. Fucking cock end. You are a bit of a cock end. <laughs> not gonna lie. Uh, well, uh, you are what you eat. I mean, what? <laughs> called that shit. I fucking called that shit. Oh, connection to host has been lost. I got nothing. It doesn't give me that or Maybe it will now. I got yeeted. Let's do, uh, um, do. I'm still loading. How did he know we'd be on Hill 400, by the way? I think a lot of people got disconnected. I'm in game still. We can try and join back, or we can pick a different server. Let's try and join back. What team do we want? Uh. Go Germany. Uh, join game. Here we go. I'm going to try and join your game. My game lets me. Shit. There we go. That's weird. I, I don't get kicked. You guys get kicked. Get it's a kicked bug. It's what's known as a mass disconnect bug. You usually you, you usually it's the other way around. I get booted, and you you're still in there. Uh, U.S. or Germany? I guess we're Germany, right? Yeah, I'm on Germany. Yeah. Okay. All right, dog armor then. Armor, but I hardly know her. All right. It's a bad idea arming a woman. <laughs> well, would you spawn. rather disarm a woman? Okay, mid. I've got a Panzer IV. Mid, mid. You said what? Mid spawn? Yeah, yeah. mid. Got a Panzer IV, mate. It's like Get the Panzer was hand. shittier That's in me. every way. What? What? Someone coming? Huh? What? That? What? Panzer IV is not a real tank. Uh, it was back in... was back in uh, El Alamein. Yeah, but what was it facing? Valentine? Matilda's? <laughs> Hey, the Matilda, the, the Matilda was a tank. It was most definitely a tank. What are you going to do with a two-pounder? Uh, chip the paint a little? I can't even fire HE rounds. And the top speed is, a, is an infantryman's you know, running speed. Where are we going, Mr. Tank Commander? Mate, well, I, I just didn't want to drive. <laughs> oh, fuck Where'd you. Where do you want to go? <laughs> Look, all I'm saying just, is... Just follow the red road. Up to where the supplies are coming in. All follow right. the crimson right. colored road with your blood. I'm going to try and act as a defensive element. That's not going to go very well, I don't think. Yeah. Well, well what would you suggest then? What I, I would suggest how... is uh, yeah, acting as a defensive element because that'll work over really well on Hill 400. But is it, is, isn't this a map where we, where, we, where we got the artillery guys so pissed off right from your sniping? Yes. Yes. That is, we were literally sitting, like, up here, and we had line of sight on their fucking artillery guns as the Americans. Yeah, 400 and some odd meters, and I headshot a guy twice. <laughs> yeah, they got so pissed off at us that they started dropping artillery shells where we were at. 
So we were like a magnet for artillery the whole fucking game. What can I like, I couldn't even see them. I, had, I was shooting at them based on Copeland's pings. Yeah. Nothing is quite more satisfying than being spotter. You get your binox out. You tag an enemy infantry and you say, take his helmet off. And then you hear pop of the fucking Springfield. And then you see the helmet just go right off the top of his fucking let's, head. Let's go and boom boom up there. Uh, uh, there. There's smoke going, going up there. There's Maybe no way they have smoke. a tank up there already. Well, there are some big charges going off. I bet that? I bet it's Artie. It's gotta be Artie. It's gotta be it. Yeah, it's definitely Artie. I can hear the uh, whizzing. Not that kind of whizzing. Kind of whizzing. Okay, now I hear it. I couldn't hear it back there. Oh my God. We'll put these trucks in the worst fucking. Well, there's a tank here that does not fire. Or is that a. Or is that a That's already. That's a, oh, it's a half truck. Oh, yeah. There might be a placeable one, though. Do we have AP or HE up? Uh, AP. Okay. So we might run into a uh, Sherman medium up here. They won't have any heavies out yet. Yeah, but like, I kind of figured we might have uh, you know, some kind of army. So, uh, TC, do you want us to get on the strong point? Honestly, mate, I have no idea when it comes to Hill 400. I just don't think you're going to be able to... I, 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 I feel like we're going to be useless on this road. Do you know what I mean? Because the elevation is is going to be fucking horrible. Yeah, which is why we're getting up to the top of the hill, and that'll solve all our fucking problems. Yeah, let's try and... I don't know. Yeah, but... None of our infantry are even on, on top of the fucking point. Do you know what I mean? Not yet. I don't know, I have a bad feeling about this, mate. What, you have a bad feeling about off-roading on Hill 400? Come on. Yeah, why? Just Hill 400. There is a road! There, bro. <laughs> there was a road. We don't need roads where we're going. Oh my god. <laughs> How much you want to bet they don't even have any tanks up and they're not going to field tanks? Alright, we got it, we got it. Don't worry. Told you, Luke. We don't need roads where we're going. Okay, maybe a little bit of a road here, yes? Yeah. Just watch our 6 o'clock up here. Airdrop coming down. That's ours. It's friendly. It's ours. <laughs> ah, I fucking stalled. That's what I get for going fourth gear up a hill. Oh yeah, here we go. This is glorious. Oh, Look out. Sure, we probably want to be turning around though, right? Yeah, once we get to a spot where that's feasible. Uh, be careful, he was right by that bunker. I got him, I got him. We're spinning around, boys. Look out. Look out. Let me heal you, buddy. You're still bleeding out like a piece of Swiss cheese. Swiss cheese doesn't bleed, it melts. Thank you. 
If you were pouring blood through the holes, it would be bleeding through it. Uh, hatch the head. I bet you they don't have any tank crews, so we can probably be safe loading HE if I guess. Yeah. yeah. Where to, tank commander? Supplies just landed there, but... Um, I don't know yeah. if we're gonna be. Uh, yeah, I think they're, they're, they're going for it anyway, because I've called it. Well, just keep a lookout for now. They are still down there. I can, I've just seen his head behind them sandbags. I'm gonna try and move us up a bit if you can. Not anymore. <laughs> nice. Killed the family, but I killed the enemy too. Acceptable losses. Fucking hell, people down here in these bunkers as well. Two, two, seven, four. Got frag out at two, two, two. Probably gonna push up with infantry back here. I think there's a guy in that bunker there. I don't know if you can see the door. You got depression? Got depression? No. All right. Hang on. You can turn us to face down that hill. Ah, shit. Have depression yet or nah? Um, I'm trying to see where I can't. I go on the line of sight now. Uh, okay. Oh, that was for us. It's to our whoa, left. Whoa, whoa. Hang on, hang on, hang on. I gotta reposition us or we're gonna get flanked by ATs. AT is somewhere in he ahead of us. There he is. Excuse uh, me. You don't wanna get depression in this. Yeah, position, I, I know, I know. We might be better off just reversing us back onto the point. You think so? So face this, face towards the bunker and then reverse. Yep, yep. Here we go. Yeah, just keep reversing. Get back to pause the bunker. Watch out, dude. You might not get depression, but at least we'll be able to cover. Ooh, I got an idea. Wait, you want to get hull down? Now here's a fucking hull down position and a half. As long as you can hit the trees with HE, that'll be good enough to kill them. Get that air burst. Poof. Well, we're gonna be fucking blind. Ah. Coming in, guys. Bombing run coming in. Bombing run coming in. Better, in Okay, I see it. Uh, it's in front. There's what? Dump some, uh, dump some HE. Just anywhere. Yeah. Oh, we, we're contesting now. We, we no must have killed some in guys front of you there. anyway, so if you want to fucking shoot with your whole gun, be my guest. Just spray and pray, because I can't see shit. I can't either, frankly. There's no friendlies in front of you. I've... my satchel senses are tingling. I bet someone's got a fucking satchel on us. Hey, cowboy. Any chance you can have a look at our tank for satchels? Oh, we might be good then. It's just we were sat in the smoke for too long. Oh, did we kill Cowboy? We did. Shit.
Garrison suit. Ah, oh, Garrison's gone on hill. Fuck. It's all right. We're still holding it. Uh, see if we can get get an HE on this tree over here. The thing right next to us. My FPS are shitting the bed right now. Got someone behind us. Fuck sake. I All right, have a I'm feeling up. we might I'm be back to I'm gone. Probably. I'm gonna try and get out. No, 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 don't. What AP, AP, AP? You got a satchel on you, bro. I think. Bomb. Oh my god. I'm on 10 frames per second. Should some playable. Fuck, he's on the left hand side. Fuck. Left hand side of the tank. I can't. I don't have much pressure on the left hand side. Ah. We're done for. I got fucking killed. See, I had him lined up. I could have killed him, but my game was playing at 10 frames. So what can you do? Where are we going now? Probably uh, mid again. Yeah, I think it's the easiest, isn't it, to get to? Yeah. Yeah, that's actually. Yeah, it doesn't surprise me. Let's see if we can get a tiger this time. Got plenty of fuel. <laughs> Who is this fuckwit? Which spawn are we going to? Middle? Yeah. Yeah. I got a long delay because I got punished. Oh no! Oh no! How dare you accidentally kill friendlies while defending the objective? Stand in front of my burrow, what do you expect? I just have somewhere. <laughs> yeah, it's over here. It's over there. Let me in first. No. <laughs> Get in, you <laughs> prick. You fucking prick. I feel like they've remodeled the tiger a bit. No, but um, I played the PTE and they've got the new smart materials on it. Like some of the other tanks. And it has forest camo. So it actually looks pretty fucking sexy. It has forest camo on the uh, forest maps. Hmm. I see a full Hill 400 tank up here. Can we, can we, can we hit Hill 400 from here? Ah uh, no, there's gonna be way too many fucking trees. You know, if somebody put a satchel on like the side of this tank, would it kill it? Yes. Anywhere okay. except the tracks. Wasn't sure. Um, Wasn't sure because someone told me that you had to put it in the in middle of the fucking tanks at the back. No. If you attach it anywhere on the hull, as long as it's not on the tracks, it'll kill it. I'm not sure about the turret. But, throw it underneath but, the tank and kill the tank. Yeah, if the tank is close enough to the satchel and it's underneath, then yes. That why AT mines hurt so much. Because it's on the underbelly of the tank, where there's probably, like, no armor. Oh, there's armor, it's just not as thick. Suddenly, frames. Back up to 40 from, like, 10. What's your problem? With I, your frames, I, mate. I don't know. You need to get hold of some new frames. Ask the uh, devs. No, I've had these frames for over a year now. They're pretty good. Flexons. <laughs> if you know anything about flexons, you can bend the ever living shit out of them and they'll never, yeah, break. never break. I have, I have a similar. Uh, I have mine where I make out of titanium or something that's super weird and flexible. Oh, yeah. They're like very expensive as shit, but you can't break them. But I did find a way. The uh, heat death of the universe will occur first. Clearly. No, I actually broke mine. They had the warranty. Oh. 
How'd you manage that? that? Oh, you know, when you're working on when, on equipment, you sort of, you know, you get things caught, and, you know, roll over the, roll, roll Ooh, over them on no. the Kind of messes them up. Yeah, that's a bit of a yikes. Yeah, they said they were in pretty much indestructible, so they had more to what is, that, was, that must be our artillery down there, right? Uh, yeah, we've got two guns active right now. You know what would be real cool is if the tank tracks would disappear, and you, if you've seen tank tracks, you'd actually track the tank by track a tank by tra tracks in the mud. Look, I've got a really stupid idea. You know how we're about to cap hill 400? Yeah. Let's go to Kirkwag. What do you think? Okay. Okay? Yep, let's do it. Not gonna have infantry support for a little bit here, but we'll get it. Well, we are, because they're planning on building garrisons and stuff down in, uh... Good. Good. Del Delta A. What? Oh, there's a truck in the road, too. Yeah, it's a dead truck. There's no tank markers, though, so I don't think they're using tanks. Oh, they're just not calling it out. Like the one, the one game we played, there were tanks everywhere. Nobody was marking them. Well, that would make them a marksman. Whoa. Caddy Wampus. How do you even spell Caddy Wampus? Don't even want to think to try. <laughs> Hey, uh, all I'm saying is, Liz Daxix are people poo. This Rexic people are cool. They are. 100%. Uh, uh, we, think, we think in three dimensions, not in two. 100% of dyslexics I've met are fucking awesome. Yeah, but it's because dyslexic, we think we think in three dimensions, not in two. Yeah. Our brain sees everything in three dimensions. Like it doesn't. We put something on, on two dimension. We look at that and we go like, that's probably why I don't. Why I'm not that good on tabletop games. You know, like Factorio, I can get into, but it, I really have to be in the mood for it. Yeah. So my brain's always trying to figure out, you know, where's that third dimension? No, where, where is it? Well, it's in the abstract. See, like, like, I can't read out, I, I cannot read, like, read from a book out loud. Forget it. It doesn't work. Yeah. So it's, like, physically impossible. Like, I'm stuttering like crazy. So I'm putting words in front of words, behind words, triple words. I need, I need to try and, uh, well... Not try. I need to go and take my tablets in a minute. My we may as well do it now before we get into the action. Okay, I'll go do it now. Back in a sec. Yeah. Remember, no alcohol. Yeah, well. Luke did say he was going to go out drinking, and then he didn't. For whatever reason. Nice, uh, nice walk through the woods, huh? Nice scenic drive through the woods. Be mount, you know, just, just cruising along, and all of a sudden the 76 Sherman shows up in front of us. <laughs> We've got AP up in case that happens, right? Yep. Yeah. Well, then we got nothing to worry about, basically. And we've got blueberries in front of us now. Yeah, recon team and uh, lone assault. Better than nobody. Yeah. Where the fuck is our Gary? It's like in E8. That's where we're at. Alright, I'm gonna split us off the road here. We'll go near where the tracks are.
funny because even though Luke's AFK, I can hear guys talking through his headphones. Through his mic, I should say. I, just, I, I thought I've seen people running across it here. Probably, <laughs> yeah. Too worried about the people. I'm more worried well, I'm about. Worried, I'm worried if, if, there's, if there are if there's enemy combatants, you know, there might be an AT up there. Yeah, possibly. I'm just gonna hope they don't have a gun up here. An AT gun. Because if they do, we're kind of fucked. There we go. Is that their artillery again? I hear something firing. Yeah, it's definitely their arty. I can tell by the report. Hey, what's that up there, Colder? I don't know. I don't see it. By Nova King. That's what? That's a uh, Panzer IV and all? That's a light tank, right? I don't know. Let me get into position. That's a Sherman. Light him up. Nice shot. I'm looking at it. I'm like, is that a light? <laughs> is that a Omar? No, that's a Sherman. Is that a tank? Oh, it's just sitting there. And then all of a sudden I see the barrel turning towards us. Shit. Yeah, well, that worked out real well for him, didn't it? My eagle eyes. Yeah. We're actually in good shape here. Good thing I had AP loaded. Yeah. I don't know if that's a steward or... No, that's a... That's a, that's a greyhound or something. Oh, yeah. yeah. Kind of looked like a greyhound from where I was sitting. Yeah, I thought, I thought I was looking. I was like trying to identify that friend or foe because our troops were. It wasn't shooting at our troops. Hang on, I gotta get us out of here. And that, that's what that's what I found confusing. It wasn't shooting at our troops, though, right? So I'm like, wait a minute, that's bad. He's it's amazing, mate. That's amazing. You've got as deep in enemy territory because you're a dick. Yeah, I'm a dick. Yo, what do you eat? Yeah. What? You know, but you know some. You know, if you're gonna insult somebody, why would you call them insult? Whoa, what's that? AT behind us. Right. Bazooka. Okay. Engine's done. Oh, he's right behind us. Yeah, he's there. Saw one guy, but. Didn't realize it wasn't the AT. Man, if only we had a, our spotter, you know. Okay. Oh, <laughs> uh. What spawn? Thinking mid again, huh? I'm just taking my tabloids one second. Taking your tabloids. mid-HQ. Mid-HQ is for the now. real gamers. Mid. This is a uh, gamers in chat. Can I get an F in chat for our tiger? Hang on. <laughs> I, just, I just I just want my level 10 tank crew. I'm level 9 right now. Hey, Crotalus, come here. Come here. Oh my god, we're clones. Luke, come here. You need to see me and Crotalus. We're fucking clones right now. Gotta take a screenshot of this.
Did you get the screenshot? One says we were going to Panzer IV mid, but it doesn't look like it's here. No, it's definitely not here. It would have shown up right next to where we're standing. Well, there's no other Panzer IV, so maybe and we've got to wait. I don't know. Let's ask him. Well, there's 860 fuel. Yeah, like... Have him give us another fucking tiger. We can definitely afford that, right? Panza Mangsh. Really? This guy must hate us. And he's better than no tank, bro. Especially if we're just going to get it fucking teetotaled. Well, I think if our spotter was with us, we would have had a better outcome. Hey, we, we still messed up that, gray, that Greyhound's day. Yeah, but like, Greyhound is 100 fuel. And 100 fuel for 600 fuel, not the best trade. Well, I think, we should, just, for him, for him I think we should still just sit on hill 400. You think so? Okay. We can do that. <sighs> Hans of Mangus. Tess just wants the good old Foy war from that, that's all. Yeah. Give me some uh, Foy US offensive. That's... Or, or Purple Heart Lane. I actually unironically love Purple Heart Lane, and I love tanking on it. It's amazing. I like Purple Heart Lane. Purple Sharp Lane? Yep. Purple Heart is a great wood to buy for a ship with. It's very expensive, though. But you know why it was called Purple Heart Lane? Because you go down there, you get Bruce Hearts. Well, there were a lot of Purple Heart awards issued to the people who fought on Purple Heart Lane, to put it that way. Yeah. Well, you've heard of the butterfly effect, right? Yeah. Well, that I'd also give you a Bruce Heart. And lungs and every other internal organ. The butterfly effect? Sounds more like a butterfly bomb. Well, no, it's, 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 it's the way a bomb affects, affects your chest and your hip and the uh, pressure wave hits you. Ah. It kind of looks like a butterfly because your heart spread, your, your lungs spread out, you know, you know and it's like, a, like, they, you know, like the shape of the wing. The butterfly wings. I thought you meant butterfly effect like. The butterfly flapping its wings halfway across the globe can no, create so a fucking. You know, it, you know the pressure wave, what it does to your lungs and that, right? It, you know, they, you know, if you look at them on an X-ray, they look like butterfly. Like you, externally, you you look perfectly fine, right? But internally, you're completely messed up. Yeah, it's that's a hell of a way to die. The cool things they teach you when you're in the military. What else like, did they teach you when you were in the fucking military? You know, like, you know it's like, oh it's kind of, you know, that's, that, that's kind of an unassuming name for a very, for a very bad thing, right? Yeah. I remember that, you know, like, like there was a couple of women in there and they're like, oh, butterflies. And he's like, it's not what you think. 
Well, if you look at a real butterfly close up, the closer you look at it, the more disgusting it becomes. Especially if you look at its face. I think most insects are like that. Look one thing that like. one thing that kind of fucks me up with insects is their compound eyes. Creeps the shit out of me. Owls are freaky. Oh, I love owls. Yeah, but they, you know, they spin their head like almost 360 degrees. That's freaky. Yeah, it's because their eyes are stuck in one place. Yeah, I know, but it's still freaky. All birds can do that pretty much, too. The, Twist their head around like that. Save really long and necks. Really long. And like eagles, e eagles have permanent high, you know, high, high zoom binocular eyes. I keep getting the feeling we're running into a tank somewhere. Well, you know, now that you've jinxed it. All right, Luke. You're saying we should hold up on uh, Hill Four. Well, our one man tank is fucking still safe. Really? It's a one-man tank. Oh, Kiki. Ponza. I feel like we're going to either crash into this guy soon, so either we move on to hill 400 and try and see down the hill, or we try and push past this guy and then push Kirkwood. Well, it's your call, boss man. Want to go hill 400? No. No? Want to go no. past? Well, they're trying to push down, so I mean, this one man tanker is not doing much, so we'll just have to uh, push past him. One woman. Or just stay behind him and let him fucking get destroyed. That's a good idea. The crewman's we'll name the one -man is Kiki, tanker. so I'm guessing it's a female. Another girl gamer oh, for my oh, collection. Like, whoa, 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 slow down. Something just blew up with that guy yeah. with that clicking. Trying uh, to find. I'm going to get us forward in first gear so that we can. Hang on, hang Something on. We need depression here. Bucket, stop! That's a really bad angle to stop at. Just wait a sec. Try and have a look round. People there coming out of the houses down there on ping. Two eight five. Definitely some sort of garrison over there. with some HE then, huh? Kiki the solo tank at Koopy Poopy One? What a name. Got enemies on to the left of us, but you're not gonna be able to get depression on it, I don't think. Is it down the hill? Uh, hold my beer. Check this shit out. Alright, now you can traverse left. No, there's no point. You're not going to be able to hit it. That's cute. They think they can hit us from the front. You're not going to be able to hit it. Where? To left, left, where our team's going, but you're not going to be able to hit it. And we've got an AT firing at us from the front. It doesn't matter, you Hence can't penetrate I... our front with a bazooka. Okay. I forget if a bazooka can get the sides of a Panzer IV, but it can't I, get I the front. Your, I don't see your ping anywhere up there. Where, where's that AT at in the front? I don't know, I was too busy it. looking left. <laughs> 
He's over there. Oh, I think that tank just got him. Oh, I think our tank commander needs to get his head out his ass, mate. Sorry, mate. I'm, I'm <laughs> too busy having an epileptic fit. <laughs> I still haven't got a new mouse, so, you know. You, uh... Still having problems with the whole zooming in, zooming out thing. You, uh, might want to do something about that, huh? Do you want to buy me a mouse as well, dear? I could, if you want me to. <laughs> Then you're gonna have to call me Sugar Daddy. I'm gonna just call you Daddy. Yeah, that works. Works for me. <laughs> Daddy. Now you're getting creepy. Got flash me a 20 for the good suck. Just do what you can for a minute. I'll be back in a sec. My dogs are barking. Just try and keep on this road and keep trying to try and keep defensively. I'll be back in a sec. Try and keep defensively. Okay. We will keep defensively. Oh, there's a, there is an engineer fixing that tank. Sedgwick. Yeah, he just got in it. I guess they're not a solo tank after all. We'll give them overwatch. They could be the meat shield. Well, what is that up on my traces there? You see that? My satchel senses are tingling. Oh, that's a three-man crew now. Yeah. That missed us. I want to know what the fuck that was. That was a rocket. You think so? Well, I'm pretty sure. I didn't hear the loud bang. I just heard the whoosh. Yeah. I bet there's a Stuart down there, because I just saw a non-penetrating hit on the side of the uh, Panzer IV. That'd be either a Stuart or a Greyhound. Can't get through the side. Yeah, check near my tracers down here. I think there might be a tank. I'm looking to see nothing in there. Okay, we got ATs behind us. We got to spin around. Spinning us now. Tried spinning it to win it. Uh, I've got a Lux at top. We've got a Puma at bottom. Nothing at mid. So which which one are you taking? I don't know. I was hoping Luke would uh come back. Uh, let's take the luck stop. Get the uh, 20 millimeter auto loader. It'll be fun, huh? Not very useful against most, you know, anything heavier than a, <laughs> than a, you know, scout vehicle, Duke Con. That's all right.
considering they got 1300 fuel already. Yeah, I've hardly been going through any of that. Commander Bug here really needs to put in some more uh, tigers. Tiger, but I hardly know her. Well, unfortunately, Luke is going to be fucking dead. So, it will be just the two of us. Be duo tanking until he gets back. Dead again, yay. Woo, we're getting good at this. We'll pick you up at a <laughs> Gary. We took the Lux because you were AFK, so uh, we'll pick you up the Gary in Golf 4. Yeah, I can get out there pretty easily. Okay. Unless you want to get us a, a real man's tank. Did you lose connection again? Fucking internet, man. What the fuck is going on? Keep telling me, man. Oh. I'll help you fix it. Yeah, maybe tomorrow. I can't be asked, mate. This day is just getting fucking... Dude. Ridiculous. Luke, let me let you in on a little secret, okay? What? The fix? that you're looking for, it's going to take, like, five minutes. Yeah, that's fine. So, we can sort that out tomorrow then, yeah? I I'm just suppose. not feeling very good, mate. My fucking okay. gob's hurting me, and my internet is just adding to my stress. That's fine, dude. Well, in that go. case, uh, have a good night. Yeah. Thanks for playing it. Tom, if we can if we can sort me in and out tomorrow, do you fancy some more planetary annihilation? Yes. I need to get used to that game. Yes. You will burn What's a nuclear milk? hellfire. <laughs> Alright then dude. I'll talk right. to you in a bit. Later. Alright, bye bye. I know I can get this. Hang on. That's a bomber. Oh my god, what are we stuck on? It's a bit infuriating, actually. In fact, I'm so furious that I'm going to turn all the way around.
Maybe uh, next game we can go recon. Oh boy. Oh boy. Somebody's there. Yeah, well. Catch me if you can, sucker. That's all I have to say. He won't hit us a second time. You wouldn't download a Lux. Wiped him off the face of the planet. He probably like, what the hell? Where'd the blocks come from? <laughs> Alright, get ready. Oh shit. Hang on. Really? Game? Alright, there's guys over there where you're looking. Yeah. Nice. AT. Did you know that bazookas are bad for our health? Because they're not even, you know, modeled after the real thing. <laughs> yeah. Alright, I'm gonna go tank commander. Let's go mid HQ. It's Panzer IV up there. <laughs> Command Delta requesting Tiger mid HQ, please. Let's see if I can get us a Tiger. Got it. Spank you. All right, he got it for us. Gonna hit a hill 400 to bottom. Hey, Just there's a hole for the crank, but where's the crank? Up your butt, around the corner. I guess we're supposed to stick our dick in there and turn it with that. <laughs> Probably. Maybe that's how the German passed their time. <laughs> Well, that, now you know why all of the tanks had female names. Like Anita and... yeah. Well, typically machines are named after women. Don't, don't ask me why. I couldn't tell you. That's for sure. Why is it from this gun barrel around with that, with that tank driver? Why you honking? Why you hon Alright boys, let's do this. No you! Yodeling Yoda. Okay, bring the gun forward. This guy is an engineer. He's trying to build nodes. That's what he's doing. I can tell you that I right know, now. I was just right going to put my barrel in, put it in my barrel in his face for a little bit. You need a push? You need a push, gamer? I got gotcha. you. Go ahead. Hey, I'm I'm squad, can you put a gas up right behind you? Just to your east. Hang on, hang on. I got, yeah, I got gotcha. you. Absolutely. Once I come back up, I sure will. Alright, that's right. I was headed there. Oh. Ran past. I don't think that's gonna work. There, it's a, I appreciate the event. No problem. 
Yeah, you prefer to still uh, the stern. Yeah, we have manual gears, you don't. I still think I still think it's funny that the taggers have two sets of train tracks that are too south wide to fit through a train with wide tracks. On. Drop one now. Yeah. Along with supplies. It's very funny. Someone get a gas up down there. I don't have a horn, or else I would honk it. We are going. We're going this way. Fail airhead. Nice kill, you made it in. Fail head. God damn. Oh, What's that noise? Uh, east of Junction. People with tiny penises. Tiny back there. Clinging to what little there. manliness they have left, which is having a loud motor vehicle. You know how I deal with neighbors like that, right? How? Well, see, up here we have the manu oh, mandatory vehicle inspections, right? Yeah. Uh, you know, so, if you take your muffler off, right, tend to one you've taken your catalytic converter off. Now you've defeated your emissions. Now you no longer pass safety. So I just usually just call, you know, yeah. our MPI, you know, Manning Public, yeah. public Insurance. <laughs> How is this guy with this Westbrook driving around with no mufflers on there? You know, he must have, you know, he must have his catalytics off and everything. How's that even real? Yeah. Um. By the way, I'm also a safety, you know, licensed safety inspector mechanic, right? So I know it's not legal. Yeah. Then the guy just gets a little letter in the mail. Your vehicle has to be in for, you know, you no, know, you, know, you got X number of hours to be at this place to have your vehicle inspected. We need help on defense. And, you know, if they don't like you, if they, you know, if they go there and no cats, well, you don't pass. Park your vehicle. Well, that fucking sucks for them, doesn't it? Yeah, well, I, I used to park my, my highway truck on, on the defense. street inside the apartment. Nobody complained for like four years, right? Yeah. So this new guy moved in across the street with a, you know, big Duramax diesel, you know. He was def, def deleted. The guy talked to the guy, right? It was def deleted and no, you know, no, like everything. Like, you know, like all the emissions were bypassed, right? Yeah. He got mad and caught said, well, you know, then he did, you know, instead of talking to me, he just calls the local, you know, the local RCMP. He was like, he called me and said, well, you're not really going to be parking there. Yeah. I said, okay, no problem. I said, I know who it is. I'll, I'll, I'll take care of it. You yeah. Know? So I won't park there no more, right? Well, five days later, like the, the guy, you know, I'm walking out, I'm walking to, you know, over to get my truck, right? And the guy stopped me and says, well, did you have to call me in? I said, no, why? Oh, well, I got called in. He said, you know, I can't have my truck on the road no more. It's going to cost me $13,000 to put, up, put it back to where it was. And oh I don't have that kind of money. And I'm just like, well, you know what, dude? Karma's a bitch. Yeah, isn't it? You know, because he was trying to say, well, I strip my I, I strip my truck all hours a day, I let it idle all hours a day, and you know, 
you know, I told the officer, I said, I said, I said that's absolute garbage. And I said, well, if he wants to push it, I said, I said, I, I said, I can have all my all the all the logs that tell exactly when the truck junction. starts and how long it runs. For. Yeah. Oh, Funny and how that works. Like, well, and the officer's like, well, you know, you're not really supposed to park in residential stuff. I said, I've been parking here for four years. No one said nothing, right? Well, you have to talk to the mayor, right? So I went to down in the office down there, which is right down the same road, and then mayor drove past my truck every day, right? He said, it's not leaking. Nobody ever complained about it, so I don't see a problem. He said, as long as you're not, you know, idling at, you know, 20, you know, six, seven hours a day, right? Yeah, I didn't care. I mean, I, I was paying for parking already. It was the same with, you know, for the trailer. I just parked, you know, so it was just easier, you know, didn't have to walk, walk it, you know, didn't have to walk for five minutes to get my truck. Yeah. But I think I wanted to be an idiot about it, well, as far as I know, he's still not driving his truck. I think he probably sold it as he was. <laughs> well, he, he said they were, they, they were talking about a big fine on top of it, right? Yeah. <laughs> and I don't know whatever happened if, if he got if he got fined or not, right? But you know that that fine can be fifteen twenty thousand dollars. Well, just remember, punishable by fine means legal for a price. Well, he'd have to pay the fine and get a, and still have to do the repair work too. Yeah. Oh, yeah. like they, when, when you completely remove a dev system and you, you guys and need? put it all back on again, that's a lot of freaking. Because he took it all off and sold it, huh? Oh, I got a lot of money for it. Yeah, well, now you're going to wish you had a pack. Item squad is depending. Is there a call? We're going to see if we can come up behind their tanks. I'm pretty sure they have an enemy tank at. Hill 400. Actually, one guy at work, right? One guy at work, his son bought a Jeep, right? It's not safety inspected. It's lifted about six inches in the air, right? You know. Yeah. Oh well, the guy, well, the guy's letting us drive it under his name so we can get it inspected, yeah, right? And like, amazing, uh, do you realize that that thing will probably never be able to be inspected because like, you've altered the suspension oh, and raised it six inches higher? Did you insane. put bigger axle, yeah. bigger brakes, wider tires, all the appropriate stuff to make it safe? No. Yeah. And I get, yeah. I don't think it'll pass an inspection. Played pretty well. Uh, it's altered, altered suspension, right? Yeah, if, 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 them, if all them components aren't DOT approved, guys. it's not going to pass. Yeah. Well, he said it will pass. I said, well, I don't care what he said. Let's say again for Tiger. Josh. Sorry, you were saying? I, you know, we take, we, no, that's, I heard a tank shot. You take a four-wheel drive vehicle, right? You lift it in the air, right? Now you've modified the center of gravity and, you know, the entire thing that it was actually... This point, and this you've modified out. everything that that vehicle was safety okay. certified to be on the road, you know, in that state, right? Yeah. So, yeah. technically, it's, you know, it no longer meets the requirements of, you know, for, you know, it has to be, it has to be all reevaluated and retested, right? And it doesn't, it just, you don't offer stuff like that. Yeah. Well, if, I mean, I guess you buy it. Like, see, like, we buy a vehicle here, and we don't have to do a safety inspection until we go to sell it, right? Like, if we sell it, or the new the new buyer has to have a safety inspection. They went on Zircol, have support. Gotcha. So, another garrison so we can modify it and do all that work and drive it for months, right? But if you have an accident, they could they they could they could they could cancel and say your insurance won't cover because it was modified. Hmm. It's kind of or, fucked or up. Kind of or someone calls and reports. Well, it's not really screwed up, right? I mean, it's, it's in the fine print if you read the, if you read the uh, you know your insurance policy, right? Yeah. Like, if you drive down a closed highway, right, and you have an accident, you're not covered. Yeah. Just like up here, if you insure it as a uh, pleasure, just for pleasure only, you're only allowed to take it, take that vehicle to and from work twice a year, I think it is. 
If you want to use it for a work vehicle, it has to be an all-purpose vehicle, which is more money for insurance, right? It makes higher risk because you're driving every day. You have to have gears. I know a guy that insured as, as a, you know, uh, like just as a pleasure vehicle, yeah, right? He used it for work and got in an accident. Yeah, and they said, nope, you're not covered. And on top of it, we're going we're, we're gonna to give you a fine for insurance fraud. Man. Somebody is sharing a screen, and as soon as that happens, he gets snowballed. So, yeah, it doesn't pay. Somebody sharing a screen? Yeah, if you look at the, uh, cool. if you look at the, uh, I think it's Mike Squad or something like that. Uh, I'm an admin and I'm watching, so yeah, no, uh, not screen sharing. Okay, okay. But that is what that means, that video, right? That little. Yeah, it means I'm an admin cam. Yeah, I mean, I just read that your I'm Pentagon is going to spend $1.8 billion to replace all of the. Uh, well, it's a nice track, guys. That, they, that they've sent to the Ukraine now, because you know, you they got to replace it for their own use, right? Yeah. One point eight billion, or point one point four? I think a billion. That's an insane amount. <laughs> uh yeah. I mean, anything with the Pentagon is usually measured in billions. You know, dollars, casualties. It's all the same to them. Billions and 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 billions. I commanded a level seven because you know you got all your XP for command already. Yeah. I'm gonna say GG in chat because that was a GG. Bug. Our boy Bug. <sighs> Elite Spanker was Baker's squad lead on their team. That's that's a hell of a name right there. The proudest banking, I guess. I guess so. Dude. Ooh, Utah Beach. We're going to be the U.S. Shall we grab a tank again? Or do you want to do recon? I, I don't care. Alright, we'll do recon. Never mind, we won't do recon, because we can't. Uh, so can. already taken. Yeah, just uh, join Charlie's squad. Yeah, Cossack wasn't around. Yeah, where's he been lately? I don't know. He's on, he's on earlier. Like, he's been on weird hours. But then he's Australian time, so... Which spawn? Mid. Mid, there's a uh, Sherman medium that we'll take. I'll come pick you up. Just walking in the water is going to be complete shit. I'm right behind you. Are you? Yeah. You are. Addicted to Yoshi Vor. That's kind of a disgusting name. I think we're gonna need AT right away, probably. No, let's do AP just in case they've got a Panzer IV. Cause they they will have a, they'll have a Panzer IV and a Lux right off the bat. Yeah, but they got a long way to cruise. Well, we'll be getting up to the front line about the same time that they will. MD-99. Nope. We're going to duo it. Mm, well, this sucks. I 
There we go. Yeah, but I've been having a lot of fun with just messing with that farming simulator. Yeah, I can tell. Just chilling out, relaxing. Uh, well, I mean, you know, when you get stressful days at work with yo-yos, what do you want? <laughs> with yo-yos. Man, look at you. Well, I mean, the guy sits there and, he, you know, and he's trying to fix a tail light that's not, a uh, license plate light that's not very bright, right? Changes the ball, but it's still not bright. I'm like, did you check the wiring? Yes. Where does it get wire power from? Oh, well, I'm not exactly sure. Well, then, how do you check the wiring if you don't know where it's getting power from? Yeah. You know, then he looks at it. Oh, it's getting power from the tail lights. I said, are the tail lights bright? Well, yes. So then it's not a grounding issue. It's not a light issue. So check the wire. Oh, I did. And I said, did you see these stupid butt connectors? The, the kind that are always causing trouble? Yes. Well, why did you not cut them out and replace the wire? Well, I wiggle them and they're good. I said, cut them out and hook the wire together and see what happens. He cuts them out, puts the wire together and the lights break. He spent 45 minutes to try to figure that out. Man. It took, it took me like 45 seconds to look at it and, and I knew what the problem was. Uh, he's been, he's been there for uh, like sir, that music hasn't been invented yet. What music? He's blasting jazz on his, uh... Oh my god. Come on. Hey, we're stuck in the hold serious? down. Yeah, if this isn't the hold down that I want. Come on. Come on. There we go. Alright. Well, I'm just trying to think positive about it. Look out, look out, look out, look out, look out, look out! Not responsible for your death if we run you over. You can't outrun a tank. Well, at least not a Sherman, maybe a Matilda. Well, see, he's got the problem called one-dimensional thinking, where you don't think about sidestepping it. You just... You just run directly, uh... Yeah, well, he runs with blinders on See my observe mark? Watch that road. That's where the uh, Panzer's going to be coming up, I think. I hear something firing over there. That's artillery, right? That's artillery, yeah. Well, I mean, you've heard, you've heard the expression, you know, they, you know, they, you know they, they walk or run, they get blinders on. <laughs> no, I haven't. Well, no right? expression. Well, um, for horses, right? Like, especially skittish horses that used to get really uh, skittish. They put blinders on so they can only see on the, on the side of their eyes, so they can only see straight ahead. Ah, yeah. So uh, that hence the expression when you see people that just walk straight ahead, they don't see what's on the side. They're, you know, they're, you know, they're running around and they're like, they're like, they're it's a truck. I bet they've got a tank over here too. Got AP up still? Is that their half track? Where? Half track? It was a half track behind us there, wasn't it? Oh, it was a wreck. It was part of the environment. Oh, okay. There were supplies there, but that's, that's our supplies, right? No, it's their supplies. It's had a truck there. Well, we could have blown them up. Yeah, we could have. All right. It'd be awesome if you could actually, you know, you know, come and do it for your own use. I think that would be much better than the option to destroy them. Because, I mean... That's what they did with supplies in real life. Oh, that's a drop supplies. There's a parachute coming down. Well, that's, that's the balloon. Yeah, it is. I, 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 I peeked around with a filter. I got one that works pretty good. So now, now I can see stuff better. That's behind us. Okay, we've got a Lux. And somewhere over here, we got Panzer IV, which killed us. Lovely. I knew I should never turn that around. Got distracted by the truck. Yeah, that's what happens. Uh, Command Charlie, we'll take a Sherman Jumbo 75 mid-HQ, please. Dude, don't waste your money on a 75. 
What you if can't I like a tiger with it? Well, they don't have a tiger. They Not will yet. shortly, I guarantee you. Tell you what, the only difference is that the 75 gets more ammo and smoke rounds. Yeah. That, no, that's not the only difference. To uh, two totally different guns. Yeah, but you cannot pen a Tiger from the front. You can still get from the sides and rear. Okay. Well, wait, what's your level of tank, dude? You want to waste the waste waste resources. Well. I am a level 10 tank commander. Okay, so am I. How many hours you got in the game? And I'm a level 9 crewman. 1,100. It's pointless to buy a 75 when you can get a 76 for fucking 100 more. I don't think it's pointless. You're entitled to your opinion. However, I disagree. Yes, nor you. Much probably doesn't want to, he doesn't want to give us a 75. You go ahead, run into 76. a tiger with a 75, see what happens. No, it's not even a fucking... He's not even the commander. He's just another squad. Another squad lead trying to think he knows the game better than I do. And maybe he does. But that doesn't give him the right to say, Oh, don't get a 75, get a 76. Command Charlie requesting Jumbo 75 mid HQ, please. Thank you. Uh. You don't know, we're a little low on resource. Not enough for a mid for a medium though. Oh, we've got enough for a 75. There we go. And there she is. All right, load AP. Thank you. Thank, Thank you. you. Yeah, but you, you you can see how I spot I spot stuff easier now that I put now that I mess with the filters a little bit. Yeah. Did notice that. Hey, uh, Jig, this is Charlie. But I got completely different settings than what he had. Like I messed yeah, with settings up? to get it where I liked it, right? Uh, if you want. Now this is entirely up to you, and I won't hold it against you if you say no. But if you want, you can go on the enemy team and get a tiger and fight us, and I'll show you what a 75 can do to a tiger. Dude, if I had my boys with me here, I would do it. But right now, I'm being squad lead, so no. All good. All good. No hard feelings, man. Just figured no, I'd no, offer. Right. You, know you should, you should say, I'll show you what a screw will do to a tiger. <laughs> oh, my God. I should. That would have been funny. Like, seriously, though, the only disadvantage that the 75 has, it can't pen the tiger from the front. Everything else, though, it can and, uh, do just perfectly do fine. And who wants to face a tiger from the front, whether you're on a 76 or whether you're, whether you're in a 75? It's a dumb yeah, thing. Because you can pen him, he's going to pen you, and you're both going to die. Sorry, it didn't happen. It's always better Pictorial to evidence, otherwise the event did not transpire. Yeah, sorry. Like, I'm like, being like, a piece well, of shit. Think, well, yeah, you, you see, you've seen me when I'm, when I'm with my taggers now, right? Like, I like to go for the engine, right? Take the engine out, and then I take my time to do the rest of it. <laughs> Yeah, I'm line him up for so that what, second uh, shot. Well, uh, that one that one where we were on St. Mary or whatever, and I, I hit that tagger that took his engine out, right? And I I, I had HE system selected because you know we were, we were we weren't expecting a tagger, right? So it loaded HE. I went killed the I killed the AT guy that was aiming at us, right? Then put my put my put my AP round in and still get the tagger before he got that barrel looking at us. Yeah. Taking the engine off is so much more fun. Ooh, we got a Puma direct out. front. Puma direct front. Traverse left. You see him? Shit. Uh, he might get our engine here. We'll see. I'm gonna break line of sight. As long as you get the uh, gun Where at the, the hell end. Is he? 
keep keep it keep it at the rear. Keep the gun at the rear. Let me know if you see him. Not yet. Oh, he's in front of us now. There he is, behind the bush. Hang on. Man, this thing always fat slow. Yeah, I know. It's eight seconds. Nice. Okay. Uh, thanks for the repairs. Yeah, I was like, holy crap, that means thing is a slow load. Wow, I missed it. What? Did they call this, they figure this is a heavy tank? Yeah. Eight seconds. Man. It's just the same I as, prefer, uh... I prefer a medium. <laughs> yeah. Thank you, engineer. Love you, bro. I got. I. I. Got, I, was, I, was, I, was, I was just. About to, I took that shot, and you just bounced, and we went right above the back of him. Yeah, I saw that. I like, ah, that first shot would have just took him right out. That's all right. We still got him. No harm, no foul. Oh, I know, but it's just you know when you're bouncing around, it's hard. To, you know, it's hard not to because they have a mimic stabilization. True. That, is, that is the main advantage the U.S. tanks have. Every one of their tanks is vertically... Alpha, what kind of tank is that? Roger to that. Oh, hey. Free truck. No more Mr. Rice guy. Every U.S. tank, even the even the Grant, which is on the 37 and on the 75 Sponson, was vertically stabilized. Are you serious? Yes. Wow, I never knew that. Yeah, they're all they all had vertical gun stabilization, so it wasn't right or left, but it was on a vertical, right? Like rudimentary, right? But still, they were somewhat accurate. Uh, building an outpost. Yeah. And you know, no game mimics that. No game copies I mean, that. Which I think is. But that's my OCD right? Well, I mean, I agree with you. Uh, by the way, there's going to be an enemy tank out here. It's going to be a Panzer IV. Let's see if we can get him. I see a tank mark at 215. Yeah, that's Charlie my tank mark. Tank. It's a Panzer IV out here. Okay. I see another marker. No, this kid just came up. Keep moving. Well, AT. It's all right. They won't get us. Uh, traverse left, left, left. There he is, right in front. Light him up. This. Hit the wall. Aim for the turret if you have to. Nice. Okay. I'm gonna close distance. He's gonna come out on the left side, so... Oh, AT got him. Friendly AT killed him. Ah, uh, they stole their kill! Uh, Alpha and Command, clear your marks. Uh, AT's got him. I was gonna. I had. I had just. I had just a little whisper in the trees. I was gonna fire. Yeah. Yeah. That first one hit the hit something in front of him. What's on your mark, Echo? What is that, Echo? It, it's an enemy tiger stationary pointing into the point. Right to that. We got a tiger up here. Well, if this tiger hits us, we're as good as dead. 
Keep the gun where it is now. You should see him. Shit. May have a satchel on us. We'll see. Alright, I'm gonna have to turn us. Ah, damn it. We, there's no infantry around us. We're completely exposed with it, with all of them around us. Yeah. Go, uh, go bottom HQ. Command Charlie requesting Sherman Jumbo 75 bottom HQ, please. Well, 76, oh, well, I, we probably can't, we probably don't got enough for 76 now. 60. Oh, he just spawned a uh, thing in here. This is 75. Man, we need to uh, get support at Chapel. We're going to lose it. Oh, God damn it. Uh, can we get some reinforcements at Chapel? We're getting kind of overrun back here. Copy on my way. Hit it. Man, I, I, I hate the fact that like, they said, oh, heavy tanks will slow reload. No. 75 millimeter gun should be the same as a medium gun. It's still the same gun. Man, can we get a yeah. supply drop at Chapel as well, so I can get a Gary down for the us? jumble should load faster because there's more room in the more room in the turret. Yeah, but that wouldn't be balanced. Uh, I still <laughs> yes. Once, just once, I want to see a World War II game like this, but where there's asymmetrical balance. To the point where it works and it's still fun to play but see historical accuracy is kind of a misnomer I I like the term uh, uh, what was it visually accurate historically plausible that's the term that armored commander uses I would say visually visually accurate yeah. Right? But technically, no. Anyone have eyes on that tiger south of LeGrand Creek? I mean, you know, like, their tanks are fairly accurately modeled, right? But they're not. Armor thicknesses, none of that is done anywhere near historical accuracy. Yeah. Right, can we get a uh, recon tank? Like armor. this 75 could be just as armored as a, as a, as a Jumbo 76, and it's not. It's a recon tank at bottom HQ. Copy that, we'll take that one. Just to save a little fuel, you know? Alright. I totally missed it, man. No, you're good, man. I'm gonna have to fire my modeling program up again and start, doing, start messing around with some models. Yeah. So, how far are you from Ohio there? Ohio. Uh, I'm a couple states over. Oh, okay. From Ohio. Well, I was just, I, I, there's one, one YouTuber I watched, he's a trucker, right? He was, I guess there's some Ohio, I, I think it was in Ohio, he said, there's a, there's a war memorial, they have a, they have a jumbo 76. Ooh. Side of it, right? Well, up here in Illinois, I've got, uh, Cantini Park, yeah, which is, uh, like a, a jumbo. Yeah. It like, doesn't have a jumbo. It has a Sherman. It, I don't think it's a jumbo. Yeah, this this I looked at this one. This this was a, this had the muzzle brake on the barrel and the long barrel was a muzzle brake. Yeah, I seen the picture. And, you know, that, that's, a, that's a jumbo. <laughs> I 
I know that I think there's one in um uh, Oh you hear that? Yep. Yeah. That's an enemy tank. It doesn't sound like it sounds like a Panzer IV, not a not a heavy. That's uh, that's definitely the tiger. They called it out really they called it out. They called it out before it's a tiger and no one said it got destroyed, so I'm guessing it's still alive. It's gotta be over here somewhere. Was that infantry to our left? I think so. We're gonna keep moving. I'm, I'm my eyes are looking for tigers. Yeah. It's fine. Like I said, I I would think about joining the line, but I I you know I don't I you know I don't want to be playing every single day hour after hour. And oh, you don't days. have to. I haven't been. Roger that. Echo. Echo right? Moving to intercept. Yep, right, right. on the here. on the mark on the mark. It's stationary. Look the chapel. Roger that. We're flanking from the rear. Keep mark updated. Is there, is there two tanks there? No, just one. I'm hearing a lot, a lot of firing going on. Watch for him. Echo right side, right side. It's going to be towards 019, I believe. There he is. You know what to do. Ha ha ha. One more and you got him. If we can get Artie to hit close to where E's outpost is. There's a look these around there. <laughs> nice shot. Hey, ask Tiger Jake. down, Tiger Jake. destroyed. So ask Jake, say, hey Jake, I thought we... I thought yeah, we used to a Tiger kill. <laughs> <laughs> I was just thinking that. Hey, uh, Jig, uh, you can eat your words now. I just killed that Tiger. Yeah, but you died the one before that, Two bitch, shots. so don't even start. Nah, it was right. ATs, man. Yeah, it's because it, it, I didn't have to. Sorry, okay. What are you firing over there? Ah, bite me, little bitch boy. Burn right, right. Not, not oh, are you, yeah. are you mad? Right. Someone crabby. I think you need to take your meds. I think you need to shut the fuck What's up. What's that rapid right. firing? I don't know. Oh, there's some lux in front of us. Shit. All I said was, I know. I sucks against the tiger, that's all. Oh, apparently dude. not. I just proved you wrong. Oh my god, dude, you can kill a tiger with fucking <laughs> satchel. <laughs> guys, shut the fuck what, what up. Is it? There's a lux over there Quit. somewhere. Bite it, Patty Slant. Somewhere in front of us, I think. There's an AT around here somewhere, too. Something hit us. Yeah, I'm gonna back us up. Jig, no hard feelings, all right, man. Just messing around. Oh, that was to our rear. Hey, uh, Greyhound, watch your fire there. What's behind us? Yep, he's directly behind us. Spinning around now. You see him out there? I don't. Got the fucking suppression effect on. I'm gonna reverse. Ooh, sending Artie on us too. We're getting all fancy. I fancy. don't see that. Whoa, 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 whoa. Okay. Oh, so it was one of ours. It's a truck of ours. Oh, yeah, yeah. Hold yeah. fire. Hold yeah. fire. Oh. Okay. We need an engine here. Alright, where's this fucking Lux? He's out towards uh, 288. 288 towards my tracers. Pretty sure. I don't see him anywhere out there. I don't either. 
He definitely sees us, wherever he is. Alright, we're going to reverse. Like that guy's like invisible. I don't, you know, he shoots at us and then you don't, we don't see nothing. You see him out there? Uh, 282. 282. Oh, he's going to break line of sight again. Hey, uh, any engineers? We need some repairs. Somebody's smoking us. Tiger on my mark. Oh, another tiger. Yeah, I know. We're being smoked. Oh, that looks just blew up. Yeah, he got taken out by ATs. Alright, we, we need to move. We gotta get out of here. Well, yeah, I know. We need to fix our tracks. We're, we're not moving anywhere very fast. Well, we're not in a safe place to repair right now. So we're going to have to get out of here, even if it's a little bit slower than usual. And then we can fix up. Thanks, bro. I heard a puma around chapel. If somebody could mark that, it's not already gone. That guy was in Jig Squad. I know he's being a fucking. He's being sarcastic. His squad lead probably bitched and moaned to him, like, oh, I'm arguing with this Sherman. But that's exactly what happened. He tried to say I started it, too, when he was the one who. That artillery's coming right at us, huh? Yeah. Too bad won't hit us. That's a Stewart. Yeah, just checking. Oh, in progress. Oh. Thank you. No oh, shit. We'll avenge you. Thank you. Someone killed our engineer friend there. Uh, Stuart, behind you, you've got infantry. Stuart, you've got a satchel on you. You've got a satchel on your rear. Oh, God damn it! Sorry, man, I would have warned you sooner if I knew. That's okay. No, that's okay. Commander was like, that's all right, now I can give you 76. I was so tempted to go into chat and say, oh, don't you mean the 75? They're just as good at taking out tigers. <laughs> oh, shit. I wanted to give him a Stuart. Works fine. Yeah. Oh, man. All right, we're going to reverse the rest of the way back. We got a bunch of blueberries in front of us. Hey, uh, Echo, you got any engineers in your squad? I'm asking around. Alright, Roger, thank you. You got someone coming to come to fix us? Yeah, I believe so. I've seen a Corsair guy running alongside it, running up towards us. Is that the engineer? Nah, he's an AT. Right to that.
realize we're friendly, right? Okay then. Huh? Was, he, was he trying to trying to blow us up? Yeah. Why? Because he's a fucking idiot. Probably a friend of Jade. Probably. I hear something over here. What's over here? Uh, that's our artillery. We're gonna have to limp back to HQ at this point. No. Mm. I could probably jump up and repair if we could get some. If I want to on the side. Uh, I don't know. Jig is around. He might try and team kill us. That seems to be what his boys are doing. Probably have to limp back to uh, HQ, get repairs there. If we die, we die. We get up, we get up, we repair it. If we die, we die. Well, there's, they're overrunning our garrison on Hill Five right now, which is where we're at. Yeah, yep. Well, we couldn't move fast enough. Uh, okay, let's go mid. See so if we've got a heavy tank out there. I wonder if that jig guy team killed that, that, that engineer that was repairing us. Could be. Although I doubt it. I think the guy who team killed the engineer was just the... Uh, uh, what's it called? Well, uh, at any rate, load HE. Once you're in. Oh, hang on, hang on. Got a guy over here. Got a guy back here somewhere. Dump an HE into the water. Or onto the truck. Yeah. Hopefully that got him. If not, he's not really our problem. Well, he's not putting satchel on our tank. Fox, what kind of tank is that on your mark? Tiger. Roger right that. Alright, load AP. We got Tiger up ahead. I haven't seen Mike around too much lately, huh? Nope. He's been keeping to himself lately. Fine by me. Right. He's the kind of guy I don't trust any farther than I can throw him. Is that our artillery? Is that a tank? Uh, it's a friendly tank in front of us. We've got friendly outing Golf Six. Probably gonna, probably gonna lose here. Definitely losing Chapel. So we are going to go to. Actually, let's see if we can ambush this tiger. Because the tiger is gonna be somewhere out here 
I'm guessing he's going to be moving on to win five so we can try ambushing him. But I'm going to get us into the win five grid squares so that we're contributing to the cap. It's funny. The tank says 76 M1 main gun, but the the the, the sight says 75 M61. Yeah, it's weird. Ooh ooh ooh. Uh oh, it's a friendly over there. It's friendly. Okay. We're gonna keep watching for that enemy tiger though, because I bet you he's gonna be crossing over into here. Infantry on Charlie Mark. I'm not too keen on firing from here and giving myself away. Oh, this guy's fucking satchel on it. What the hell? I guess he got it on us. That's alright. We're about to lose this game anyway. The only time that people even talked on command that was when they were giving me shit about ordering a 75 instead of a 76. Spawn. Uh, just go mid. We don't have a tank here, but Command Charlie requesting a 75 mid HQ. Jumbo 75. Thank you. Reload time at Jumbo 75 sucks. Yeah. got that heavy armor though that's what we need load he can go up to red roof house Yeah. We do have a friendly tank over there. Go we'll destroy enemy garrison on WN7. Nice. What's up? Alright, thank you. What's out here? ATs. Enemy ATs. Yeah, we went out, went out there everywhere. Yeah, it's kind of what I'm thinking. You know, six quads and six, you know, so that's six ATs you can run any map.
This is Charlie. We're going to move up to Satchel. Sorry, not Satchel. Chapel. They just dropped a soldier right in front of us. Yeah. I'm aware. I'm a little bit worried. Hangar out there. Yep. It's unspotted. I'm guessing it might be a tiger. Uh, load AP. Unless AP is already up. We're going to put some distance on that and then flank it. AP is over here. Us. Yep, it's all right. All right, watch the left side here. Uh, all right. Oh, that's directly in front of us. That is a tiger. Shit. Might be in some trouble here. Dead half track in, uh, hide Freaking Lux out there, too. Where is that tiger at? He's behind the bush at 264. I'm playing like shit tonight. Situation Let's take the steward at top spawn and flank him. Go for the humiliation kill. We need a garrison up. I mean, it's ridiculous. I mean, we stop for two seconds and we have no infantry around us and they just AT us. They just, yeah, just charge the charge. Boom, 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 boom. Well, part of that is my fault because I moved us up a little bit too far. Uh, Charlie's tank mark is an enemy tiger. Yeah, but the point is, infantry is supposed to move with tanks. Tanks aren't supposed to, aren't supposed to go ahead. But, you know, you know, they're supposed to work together. They're yeah, well, that yeah. that was my bad. I pushed too far up. All right, load AP. All right. Let's see if we can emulate our success that we had that one. Not, with, beach, not, when, yeah. not when you got like six. You know, the enemy's got like six AT crews running around you. That's all right. We'll go along the top edge of the map. They're not going to be up there. Oh, shit. That's what I get for driving with the map open. <laughs> Bounced right off of that hedgehog. It was funny. Like, the whole okay. the whole, the whole tank versus anti-tank meta is completely one-sided in this game. It's just... Yeah, I know. But, I mean, what can you do? People need to complain and then just say we're not we're, we're not playing your game till you fix it. And when 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 the player count goes down and servers go empty, they're gonna fix it. Yeah, but that will never happen. Because idiots will still play. Because idiots don't idiots just say, well, well, you know, we like it. The ATs like it for sure. Command, can I get a recon south? Recon tank. It's the ATs who don't know how to penetrate a tank that complain that they shoot 10 rockets at the front of a Tiger and it doesn't do anything. It's those people who make the devs say, oh, well, maybe we're going to make the ATs more powerful then. Instead of educating them on how to properly play, they make the game 
harder and harder for tanks. Well, I got half a mind to, to, to write up a detailed specification list of a tank and say, if you're going to call yourself historically accurate, make it historically accurate, and you know, or you know, or change your letter, change your, your you know, your description because it's nowhere near historically accurate. Yeah, but they're not going to care about that. That's the problem. Well, they problem. will care about that because I mean, uh, in certain countries in the world, they can be legally fined and charged for that. Well, I think, I think the term historically accurate is vague enough to where they could probably get away with they're it. Not I mean, even, they're not even close to historically accurate. It's laughable. Got AP up? Yep. All right. Can get around behind this tiger then. I mean, this game is more historically as, as historically accurate as you know, you know, DRG is you know a game based on reality. <laughs> yeah. DRG doesn't need to be based in reality. I know, but what I'm saying is that to call us historically accurate, it's visually accurate, but that's all they have. Yeah, but they could argue, oh, well, when we say historically accurate, we mean visually accurate. Well, then there's a term called, you know, truth in advertising, and, you know, wording it. So that it, it means, you know, wording it visually accurate. If I sell, if I go and sell, if, if I'm a used car salesman, I say this car is in like new condition, right? And you hop in that car, and the seats are torn and everything. Else, well, it looks like new from outside. You know, you're going to be in front of a judge. Yeah. I just don't see it happening. We're all well, because no, again. because every, because you know the people don't, you know, the, the people don't care enough to do it. All right, start looking for that tiger. He's out here somewhere. I bet you we're gonna come up behind him. Yeah, just, uh, What's up? So I just heard something blow up. Yeah. Got an enemy truck in front of us. Guys. We might cap well, that could be one was. I'd be trying two enemy garrisons. Just try to be in the right place. Try to be in I the right place. I don't have tigers Well, if he's smart, he'll be up Which here. Alright, see the truck in front? Well, right now it's HA. That's an enemy truck. Heavily contesting. Ah, God damn it. Might be able to get him with the coax. He didn't get a supply zone. Let him have it. He's dead. Mm, no, he's still alive. Oh shit, sorry. I need to get a quick carry up. Yeah. Hey, Ross, I think cake. A lot, apparently. Probably because you had AP up and punched right through. Oh, he's going to be somewhere over here. I just heard a big gun, big shot. 
There he is. Uh, west of WN5, tank marker is accurate. Hang on, I'm gonna pull forward a bit so the shit is not in the way. There you go, nice. Now that's messed up. You, put, you can punch right through without destroying it, but ain't you destroy it. Hmm. It's a friggin' supply truck. The supplies are explosive, you know? Yeah. Oh, whoops. We need, we need, we need to have some eyes in that tagger. He's, uh, by WN5, so... As I suspected, he moved up. Let's see if we can get in behind him again. Oh, that's a lot of infantry in front of us. We're gonna get the fuck out of here. I didn't even blew it up. <laughs> Lots of infantry Maybe on Charlie him. Mark. Maybe because you, you can't hit the tarp, you gotta hit the frame, right? The tarp goes. Oh yeah, through. that's it. If you hit the tarp, that would have done it. Okay, load HE. We're gonna have a field day killing some fucking infantry here in a second. Yeah, we're gonna die here. Uh, maybe, but we're gonna kill a lot of infantry. There's gonna be three or four AT sitting in there, and we're, we're gonna get two kills and be dead. It's all smoke, you can't see shit. Sorry, just send some HE over there anyway. Four second reload. Enemy garrison destroyed. <laughs> Destroyed enemy garrison on chapel. Destroy garrison on chapel. <laughs> India, what kind of tank is that? AT, AT, AT. Yep. Don't know where from. We're probably dead. He's probably got us. No, not quite. Did you? It's over there behind that flaming rack of something. All right, left side, in front of the church. Got some guys over there. All right, let's get out of here. I don't like this anymore. Actually, in pretty good shape here. Nice. You got him. He's fucking dead. Uh, lay some HE the smoke in front there. They're dropping. They're dropping. They're dropping. They dropped two supplies in there already. Alright. Enemy supply drop on Charlie's garrison, Mark. They're gonna rebuild that garrison we took out. Yeah. I bet that's what they're gonna do. Enemy outpost destroyed. <laughs> oh, I just saw a body go flying in that church. Outpost destroyed on chapel. Enemy outpost destroyed again. Times two.
Hey, uh, Lima, can you build a Gary out here? And supplies for it. Ooh, you know what? We've been neglecting that enemy tank wherever it is. Yeah, well, we, we, got, the, we got other things. Got turrets. Yeah, we're probably dead. Yep. If I was a little bit faster there, we might have gotten out, but... Well, we've got seven vehicle kills so far. That tank was just <laughs> taken out. We got five yeah, that structures. Was yeah, that was we got five structures we destroyed. Well, like I satcheled one of the other ones, then. Oh, nice. Yeah, they've got a couple of noob tubes on chapels, so we got fucked up. More spawn. Hmm. Man, we'll take a Jumbo 75 mid-HQ, please. Gotta love the 75. Hey, we did good in the little, uh, little Stewart. All right, we'll just take the medium that's here, then. Oh, it already got spawned in. Never mind. Okay. Over this way. Hunter <coughs> Biden. We'll make a name like Hunter Biden. Funny. That's the last name I would choose. I don't even want to associate with that. Defense are coming in north at WM. Some people have sense of humor in this game. Batter the idolizer guy. Yeah. Yeah, I kind of I kind of like the new farming simulator because you have to watch your crops. None, they don't all ripen at the same time. It's a lot like a lot more realistic now. Load he. <coughs> don't forget, we got a tagger up there. I haven't even dealt with yet. Uh, he actually got satcheled. Or the infantry called it out. I forgot to tell you that. Like right after we died. One of the people said that they got the tiger. Uh, the defense is looking light. I think that's why. I you have to admit, when you look at the bottom, I put them filters on. I can, I can see them guys in bushes all far. Oh, yeah. It's good. I still have yet oh, to I mess around with that. Oh, yeah. When I got taken out. Yeah, I mean, I, I got completely different settings than what he had. I just messed around with what, you know. You, you, don't, you don't see any farther. It's just you can see clearer what you, what you see, right? Yeah. I think we it doesn't. It doesn't remove the fog. I guess you know, like fog is maybe where the fog is. I mean, that's, yeah. Well, nothing's going to remove the fog unless you do that. You know, they, they, you, know, you, know you know, you know, the, 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 you know, the, the best way to, to really to, to really make, to really get the devs on this game to do something. Yeah, what's that? Yeah, what's that? We actually have like, you know. Several actual tanks in in a in a game engine that were running around that looked fairly realistic and said, "Yeah, you know, you guys want realism? Well, you know, check out what realism is." Yeah, <laughs> I could I could see that maybe making a little bit of a difference. Well, I mean, like if you were, like if you were, you know, if you were to go through and then, you know, like and do it like, you know, like they did in uh, Battlefield 2, where you could assign, you know, armor plate, armor plates to various thicknesses and penetrations, etc. Et well, where is that from? Behind us, it's an AT. Friggin' AT, like, what, like why? Are, like, our soldiers are everywhere behind us. How are these hitting us? Where? I don't know. You know, I mean, jig shooting at us? I mean, I don't know. Like, 
Everybody no. Down. Well, we couldn't have been shot from behind. There's all friendlies behind us. We're shot from behind, though. With all these friendlies. Yes. It's only where... It's the only place an AT can head. Alright, here we go. Well, I mean, that's awful suspicious to me with all this, this number of friendlies here. Well, friendly infantry can't damage us, even if they tried. Well, I know. I'm just saying, you know, we didn't really take a whole lot of damage. I mean, look at what, I mean, it's not much. I'm thinking that was a side hit, probably. That was for us. Uh, I think that's already... Destroyed enemy up. That was definitely for us. I'll find my traces in the smoke out there. If that's a tiger, we're dead. <coughs> I think it's a Panzer Ford. It's reloading too quick to be a tiger. Yep. I can't yep. see anything over where you come with smoke. Sorry. Okay, see the green tracers coming in? No, I don't. All right, watch my trace out of here. I'm, I'm too busy looking at AT guys while they're shooting at us. Which spawn? Uh, go mid. We got a Sherman medium here. Okay. Look, there's uh, supplies north of you if you can get a garrison up there. There's a tiger on chapel. Uh, I see 50 supplies, but that's not enough. That was, like, when, when we had like two AT guys and then a, and a tank shooting at us, and, our, and we're surrounded by our troops. Yeah. Uh, Garrison on the defense point. <coughs> All right, load AP. I'm gonna get a little bit cheeky here. on my uh, tank paint. Roger that, Lima. That's the one that took us out. Why'd you let him do that? We didn't see him in time, that's all. Plus we had uh, AT infantry all over us. It's kind of hard to look for a tagger when you got AT shooting and it can, you know, like, cost, you know, like, multiple teams of it. Yeah. That's the, that needs to come to an end. I mean, like, like you can't have an AT crews out and out numbering the, the tank crews. That's ridiculous. Yeah. Hey, uh, Lima, do you know which direction he's facing? Because we're going to try and flank. Load AP, by the way. He was facing already, uh, south, right. engagement southwest. Copy that. <coughs> half track is dumped. Yeah, it's our half track there. Oh, I know, but it's just dumped. I mean, oh, oh. Yeah, that's yeah, for us. facing east. Where's this tagger supposed to be? Roger that. Fresh paint. Uh, I'm gonna drop a marker on him. He's off to our right. We won't have line of sight on him yet.
Uh, defense are coming in south. Alright, traverse left to 12 o'clock. We're gonna spin us. Okay, he should be direct front. Oh shit, there he is. We're already dead. He's looking at us. Oh, what? He ricocheted. Holy shit. Get around him. I am. Alright, he's on our left side. So, uh, keep the gun forward. Here we go. Do you see him? Fucking AT again! I'd love to see his kills. Like, we stopped the, the AT. Like, it's, it's like there's like six AT teams out there. We almost got him. We got ambushed by ATs. Like, I had his engine. One more hit, he would he'd have been gone. All right, go top swan. We'll get the Stewart. Like, this is what pissed me off of this game. Like, it, it's not even balanced in the slightest. Yeah, I know. I don't like it either. Well, I think it's time to start recording all the all the all the idiocy that goes on in this game and say, yeah, here's your here's your wonderfully balanced, historically accurate game, <laughs> as the devs call it. <laughs> and when you get enough YouTube views on it and they start seeing it, they're gonna be like, oh well, um. Problem is right now there's nothing else out there, and that so they, so they just do it. Yeah, pretty much. Let's post script them, but it's not See, much it's competition. Not. Hopefully, post script them gets better. <gasps> um. Quite, quite frankly, Battlefield 1942 was ten times the game this is. I actually own Battlefield 1942, I just haven't played it in fucking forever. I mean, it was a way better game than this. Mm, leaps and bounds. I believe it. Okay, not all the pretty graphics, right? But, I mean, was leaps, the combat was leaps and bounds ahead. Battlefield 2 was way ahead. The Battlefield 2, you, had you could have individual armor thicknesses for the front of the tent, the back of the tent, the sides. Yeah. And you, you, you could actually, you know, cal you know, you know, dial in your weapon, your 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 your, your shell to, you know, to hit with a, you know, roughly the same energy it would have in real life. Echo, is that the tiger on your mark? Like, I just had a bad feeling when we went in there and there was none of our blueberries around us. I said, yep, yeah, we're going like, That tag is going to have... He's, he's got eight, eight T's around him. Sure yeah. as shit. Come can you send me supplies here? On, uh... Sagama is requesting Jake. join your unit. Sagama. Is your command? What's up? Got me that. The 
ultimate hull down. Oh, uh, you guys are back there. Yeah, we're we're out here. We've been duoing this whole time. I wish I could airdrop in over there. Are we stuck? Yeah, yeah. I think so. You can, can get us out of this. There we go. Friggin' AT again! Yep. Like, what is with the ATs? They're a friggin' plague on society. Wow, so this game is, uh... Yeah. We've captured a lot. And we're not, we're not doing too uh, hot. Got fucking ATs everywhere. ATs have ruined this game completely. Go bottom HQ. Are you still alive or are you dead? No, nah, I'm dead. Command Charlie yeah. requesting a Jumbo 76, bottom HQ please. Jumbo 76. Thank you. Feeling big. All right, Sugma, how well can you drive? I'm good at it. Drive. All right, sweet. Go ahead and jump in then. I hate how you can't run through water, but I guess that is physics. So. Yeah, it's annoying. By the way, uh, Crotalus and I are hot miking it in Discord right now. So I'll just give you orders through uh, squad chat. All right, let's go forward. Let's go forward. AP. Let's get yeah, onto the back. strong point of the move mark. There a lot of uh, enemy tanks. Uh, a few of them, yeah. Is that why we have this? Yep. That plus uh, people didn't like that I was ordering 75s when there were tigers up, even though we killed a tiger with a 75. I guess they didn't think it was good enough or something. So I figured I'm I'm tired of people calling me out. So I may as well get a 76. Pure pressure, you know? Yeah, you know, if you have to take a 76, you can take one from the team and take a 76. There's definitely a tank up ahead somewhere, probably on the other side of the smoke. That's a yeah, but we... Going going slow. What was that? That was AT. We yeah, it's behind us. Turn. Turn left. Just turn left here. Yeah, he's gonna shoot us again. He's lining us up. Ah, uh, they got a fucking satchel on us. Oh, I wish we had infantry. Uh, Alright, drive forward. Just straight forward. Roger that. This is gonna be fun. Yep. Tiger in G6. Figured. Ooh. <laughs> it's a satchels, man. 
guess that's what you get for uh, calling in a 76, right? Well, I'm at bottom spawn again. I don't know what that tip does. Yeah, pretty much. Let's take the Greyhound. If we move fast enough, we're not going to... Oh, shit. Oh, it's probably GG. Uh, we can stay like this for a minute. I'm just gonna sit back and wait till the end of the game just to get my XP because I'm just this 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 is, just pisses me off too much. This is just absolute BS. This is, this AT is way too fucking stupid. Well, I'm not going to bother uh, tanking anymore. So, probably better Should off. We'll take that cap. So we can get on to the next game. Yeah, I'm of the opinion that we should just let him have it at this point. Anyway, thanks for trying. I'm probably going to make an AT uh, infantry squad. All right. We are Fox Infantry. I mean, like, it's so overbalanced and ridiculous. Yeah, I know. It's like lo totally lopsided. I mean, you, you, they must have a full of six AT squads running around. Take uh, AT and spawn in on the half track. We'll see if we can kill that tank. Back in a minute.
Okay, I am back. Yeah, just just to give you some some quick reading, some quick information, okay, Colbert? Yeah. Okay, here's what. Here, okay, the primary the primary armament armor, armament of most U.S. tanks was stabilized in elevation, starting with the M3A1 light tank, the M and the M3 medium tank. That's the Stuart and the Grant. In early 1941 except for the 105 millimeter equipped M4 Shermans. Some Shermans had 105 millimeter on them. you know that? Uh, all US built tanks have stabilization for gun elevation at usable low speeds by 1943. And all US tanks were stabilized, right, by 44. Yeah. Soviets were stabilizing their guns, make, attempting to stabilize them as early as 1938. Hmm. Uh, U.S. tanks with single-plane gun elevation stabilization, stabilization were found to be more effective at engaging targets while moving at speeds of 10 miles per hour using stabilization. Interesting. And it says it, it uh, lend lease tanks did not get the stabilization. Only the U.S. tanks had it. Got it. Uh, half track spawn's not there. Yeah, it got blown up or something. I got killed by uh, our commander. What? Yeah, I come back and it said you were killed by your teammate Hunter Biden. Did he he was our yet? commander. Oh, I don't know what he did. Probably. Which spawn are we gonna go out? Either way, he's gone now. He's no longer in the game, so he probably got kicked for team killing. Ha. Huh. Uh, I'll put an outpost in. Alright, outpost and sub. Yeah, so like I said, when they say realism, where's my gun stabilization? Yeah, that's kind of how I feel. You know, I mean, that's like, uh, you know, there's a bit of a hoopla going on right now with that one farming game, Cattle and Crops. Yeah. Because they made a bunch of promises and they, you know, they, you know going on three or four years, they haven't even delivered on, on a third of them. It's all of their Kickstarters, huh? Yeah, same for this one. Well, Seven Days to Die was, was starting to renege on a lot of them, right? And I don't know what happened, but there was some talk that uh, Kickstarter was going to make them start refunding money to the, to, the, to the Kickstarter sponsors. Oh, really? And then miraculously vehicles and all that got added into the game. Isn't that funny how that works? Yeah, I'm dead already. Yeah. They're all over us. Well, we can't win anymore anyway, because it takes four minutes to cap two points, and we're at three and a half left. I just, you know, I mean, you know, before they did that last uh, patch where they changed the balance with the, AT, with the you know, and, and the, you know, it, it, the game was somewhat enjoyable, but now the AT is rule. Hey, uh, Party Shark, I wish you were here at the beginning of the game where people are giving me shit for, uh, requesting a Jumbo 75. <laughs> Got all recorded at any rate. Someone put the music. Oh, it's hey, in that lovely. Everybody loves the 75. Huh? It's a cool paint job. He I agree. Smoke. Yeah, smoke, yep. The only thing that a 76 can do better than a 75 is penetrate a tiger in the front armor. 75 can do everything else. In real, well, I mean, a, technically speaking for tanks, a 75 medium is a better tank. Because it reloads faster than the 75 heavy. 
Well, yeah. So if you're gonna be if you're gonna be going after no, after, on, after no, if you're gonna be running a 75 going after tag, you're better off in a medium because you got you got you got you're a little quicker and you got a little, you know much better reload time. Right now, you can get them two shots in the engine more quicker. This is interesting. Yeah, I Look out. Panzer four on Fox, Mark. Uh, I think that's me done for for now. Uh, it's kind of you know, it's kind of aggravating. Oh, I got promoted level ninety. I'm a ninety level ninety three now. Nice. Ah, uh, well. Thanks for playing. At any rate, I'm probably gonna go take a load off. But I will catch you later. Okay.